is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart so Hello! We have an 8 hour layover here in Dubai So I decided to book myself a hotel room for the night An airport hotel room I think I paid 140 bucks it is pricey, but I got everything what I need here, like the bathroom, I was able to shower, they have complete toiletries here, so it's not that bad. I wanted to have a nice sleep because I wasn't able to fully rest for our flight, so I think I just, you know, I deserve it. I always say that I deserve it. You'll probably do the same if you have an 8-hour layover, right? So, cheers. See you guys. And I'll see you in a bit. There's a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves Hello everyone! We are out and about exploring Bye. And taking videos with the team Kim's taking photos. This is a viewing deck of all of the uh, super yachts. I think the most expensive yachts are all here in Monaco. A lot of people said that this is actually a billionaire's playground. So it's not for me, you know. <laughs> One day maybe. So we found this area where you can take photos. With this view, now I don't think you can cross that one i think it's exclusive for guests but yeah this is the view damn that's like bigger than my uh, whole barangay in the philippines you know also the f1 grand prix will be held here next weekend so i'm super excited that we'll be able to witness it for the first time hopefully this is the outfit i'm wearing blue the shades i got my hair perm still need to be like an island girl you know with my puka sh ay not puka shells ano to t shells yung pang sungka best <laughs> ninako ko lang to sa bahay yung pang sungka charet we are here actually for work for production that's why martin has been like taking lots of b-rolls or establishing shots are you happy yeah it's always nice to get a couple days of uh, fine tuning all the equipment before mm -hmm. For shooting for clients. Mm. And this is our hotel, Hermitage. This is the view. A lot of uh, buildings. It's like a mountains covered with buildings. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that I'll be able to see Charles Leclerc or Max Verstappen. <laughs> Just a few minutes walked, only took me one, two minutes. I've reached this area where you can see a lot of like the super yachts. It's also a nice place to chill and sit down, like this lady over there. After walking around on our first full day here in Monaco, 
we decided to have our lunch here in Cafe de Paris. It's really pretty inside. It's also nice outside. This is outside. However, I think we don't want to miss this beautiful architecture. So the price range is about 20 to 50 dollars or euros here. So it's a nice place to take photos, but if you are on a budget, I don't think this is a place. But it's so nice to, you know, go for a date, which we are now doing. Today has been a, a nice day. The weather outside is nice and sunny, but it's also breezy at the same time, not humid, which I really, really love. Hi, Alvin. Hello guys, Martin here. If this is your first time seeing me, my name is Martin, full-time YouTuber, Avis fiance. I don't know if you've been watching the vlogs or not, but really happy to be here in Monaco. Gonna stay for one week. We are here for a very big air production. We are producing a documentary for a crypto project, which is what we're gonna spend the next seven days doing. So there won't be much time for me to, to vlog, but Avis is gonna make a video from this whole experience, which is gonna be super cool. But check it out. Wonderful, really cool engravings. This is why I love Europe because it has so much history in the walls and in the buildings and in the architecture. We are having two days before our client arrives to catch up on some stuff, do the shopping we need, and then I won't be much to see after that because I will be focused. I'm the film director of this documentary slash the filmer as well. We do our rigs and our productions very lightweight. We're four people only, but um, I am confident we're gonna make something very cool here. Over and out from Martin. Hold on, put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Welcome to Monaco. And as you all know, in every travel vlog, there is always a room tour. Hey, 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 hey. So Martin's gonna do the First Monaco room tour. Hey, yeah. welcome to our uh, beloved uh, king size room. Very, very nice. We're staying at the Hermitage. Hermitage. I don't know if I pronounced it right. Hermitage. It's a very, very nice hotel. Very close to the casino and it's on the hill. So some of the rooms have very nice views of the harbor, which we got very fortunate. Our room has that. Let's start with the view. I think we just need to show them. Please show them. This is our view. Oh my gosh. Our view looks so sick. You can see how huge the hotel is. It's, it goes all the way up to there. That building, probably downstairs. Oh my gosh, you can see the super yachts here. I believe the F1 race car drivers will be here as well. It is a really huge property. So this is our room, our king size bed. Yes, and then we have some chair here. We can put mm -hmm. stuff. We have a large TV. We have. Cabinet. Look at the detail. Closet. The Ooh, said this the is hotel, our closet. I believe she said the hotel was built before sometime in the 1800s. Oh, okay. We got our safety box here, some fresh bathrobes, and right over here, what's over here? Still the closet, and with our laundry bag for shoes and a, like some sort of a mini bar right here. I really love the interior. I haven't been in a hotel like with this extravagant interior before and my god <laughs> and this is our bathroom oh la la look at our bathroom we have our own tv right here in our bathroom we got the toilet here here in france they have their bidet looks like this so you have to stand up after doing your thing and you do the bidet right here and there's new more robes. I think this is for the spa, which we will be exploring later on. And the sink. Oh, the shower. I forgot the shower. This is the shower. And that ends our room tour. Every time I check in in a hotel or an Airbnb, the first thing that I do is unpack my stuff. Especially when we're staying for a couple of days or a week. So just to keep myself organized or say I'm not an organized person, but I still would love to see my things, my clothes that I'm wearing instead of just putting it all in my suitcase and making it a mess. These are the few things that I brought with me. Of course, I need a, like a business attire. This time I brought a lot of shoes because we're going to have a gala dinner, like formal wear attire. So I need to play the part, you know? Never. This is from my friend, a good friend of mine. She lent me this. Instead of buying a new gown, 
which will cost me so much. It's nice to have good friends that is also in your size. <laughs> I also have an extra one just in case there will be another like formal event wear. I just got this from Zara. I haven't even worn this. It will take a while for me to unpack my stuff so I'm just gonna show you guys a time lapse. There's another elevator. I don't know where to go. Wait lang. Okay, I'm going to the heated pool. back in the hotel freshened up changed outfit you guys look at this they gave us macarons macarons i'm gonna try this out ito yung mga social na macarons mahal to eh kaya libre sulitin na natin Shiring. oh different color it's like a um, nude palette well nude palette One? One. One bite. Ay, you eat the whole thing. Tastes like camote. Mm. Let's drink. Evian. Sorry. Oh, we're outside of our hotel and these are the cars that are parked. We are out. We're here walking around Monaco. <laughs> The center, close in the, to the center, casino. yes, and uh, this is where most of the luxury brands are. Yeah, trying to find a place where we can eat. My God, we're all really hungry. <laughs> oh, look at that car! My gosh, honestly, I've never been in a place where I find luxury cars everywhere and people wearing luxury brands. I think everyone is wearing this one piece. So, um Good. Oh my God. That's a big meat. That's a big meat for the big boy. <laughs> what are you having? I'm having pasta. Pasta. <laughs> yes. With a lot of pasta. Yeah. I'm and having the poke bowl. Same as mine. It was kind of like a secret menu item. She just said that, hey, we have yeah. poke bowl. And you know me, I love poke bowl. We love the poke, no? So I've been keeping my eyes on these Hermes slip-ons. Hopefully they have my size here. Looks nice. Feels comfortable. Wow. Hello. I finally got it. I bought something that I never thought I'd buy, but I just couldn't resist it. I got the St. Louis bag. Ah. It's so big and spacious. I love it. This is what it looks like. This is the color. There's even like a, a purse. Ooh. So happy.
Hello, I am back here in our room just to eat the leftovers that we had for dinner last night. It's already 1.30 and I haven't eaten lunch. I'm so overwhelmed by everything that's happening right now because I just met the freaking co-founder of Netflix. Do you guys have an idea how inspirational he is? Like he started off as mailing DVDs in the US and now Netflix is so known worldwide that even a baby knows how to say Netflix. to get to another boat it's already six practice is over people are uh, ready to party for us we're ready to sleep sailed from Cannes and today is a busier day because today is the preliminary I think actually I'm not so sure I'm just here riding the way <laughs> but it's a really cool experience and everything that's been happening since day one has been awesome and I hope you guys are enjoying it so far enjoying the journey with me everything is so new to me Good morning hi, hi. I have never seen a boat traffic before. My first boat traffic experience. Before. I'm used to the Manila traffic. The Banka traffic. Yeah, the Banka traffic. But this one is like... This one is the bougie traffic. Yeah. <laughs>
inside the truck again. The cars are really loud. Wow. So we're in a plaza where you can buy merch of your favorite team. I like McLaren, Daniel Ricardo and Land. And those are, I think, Red Bull, Aston Martin, and we got Martin. Hello. <laughs> okay, so we're buying merch now. I'm gonna try the Ferrari cup. How much? 30 pounds. What do you what do you think about this? Ooh, cool. I like red. Yeah. What's up? Hi, I'm here to sell yourself some pizzas. Okay, black is actually cooler. It's cooler? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's sick, man. That's sick. Good on you. Super cool. Okay, so now is lunch time. We're trying to find a place where we can all get together and uh, grab some food. Because we're starting to get a little hungry in the yacht. There's not a lot of food in the yacht like, to fill you up. You need some food, some heart, some good food, you know? So I'm happy with my hat. It's 60 euros. I wanted to get the Ferrari with didn't feel right, so said as it is. Really? They're screaming now. Thank you. 